The question is the partnership between A and B was dissolved on 31st March 2017. And the last sentence tells us prepare realization account, partners capital accounts and cash accounts showing distribution of a distribution to partners. Here we have been given capital accounts, loan accounts, no asset is there. Hence, to find out sundry assets, we have to prepare in the working notes memorandum balance sheet of A and B before dissolution. We have assets and amount with rupee symbol and liabilities amount with rupee symbols. We have to start from the liability side. A's capital account rupees 170,000, B's capital account 30,000, A's loan account rupees 1 lakh, trade creditors rupees 2 lakh. And in the asset side, B is loan 20,000 because B has taken the loan from the firm. And here, in case of A's loan, the firm has taken the loan from A. And we have to total the liability side 5 lakh, take it to the asset side and deduct this B's loan account 20,000. We will be finding sundry assets as a balancing figure rupees 4 lakh 80,000. Then next one is your fair notes, memorandum realization account, two sundry assets rupees 4 lakh 80,000, buy trade creditors rupees 2 lakh, and buy cash account assets realized, it is 4 lakh 50,000, it is given in the question, and to cash account liabilities and expenses paid, trade creditors rupees 2 lakh paid in full, then Total the debit side rupees six lakh eighty thousand. Take it to the credit side. Find out the difference rupees thirty thousand. That is by capital accounts loss and realization transport in ratio of A is to B. That is equal to two is to one. Hence A will be getting rupees thirty thousand multiplied by two third. That is rupees twenty thousand. And in case of B, it is one third rupees ten thousand. Then your partner's capital accounts by balance brought down rupees one lakh seventy thousand and thirty thousand, and two realization account loss and realization transport twenty thousand and ten thousand rupees for A and B respectively. Now total the credit side, take it to the debit side, find out the gap for payment. A will be paid rupees one lakh fifty thousand, B will be paid rupees twenty thousand. Then your cash account. It is to B's loan account. B has taken the loan from the firm, hence he has to give money to the firm. It is cash account debited to B's loan 20,000. To realization account, asset realized 450,000. Then by realization account, liabilities and expenses paid rupees 2 lakh. Then by A's loan account rupees 1 lakh. By A's capital account rupees 1 lakh 50,000 by B capital account rupees 20,000. This is the final payment to A and B rupees 1 lakh 50,000 and 20,000. And the totaling is rupees 4 lakh 70,000 both debit column and credit column. And this is the final answer.